Hey guys, it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So here is last week's spread using, according to Allie's Butterflies and her Neutral Alcohol Ink, and I love the way that it is turning out. So for this week, uh, the week of August 30th, it is my kids' first day of school on September 1st. So I will be using, this will be the first kit that I've ever used from the Coffee Monsters Co. Uh, and it's her back to school kit. Now this is made for the Hobonichi cousin, so it's gonna be a little bit smaller than the columns, but I'm excited to see it uh, work. And then I'm gonna bring in some of this washi. I can't remember what this one is called. And then maybe some of the other Coffee Monsters Co. washi that I got as well. Ooh, let's get started. So the first thing I normally do with these uh, types of spreads is I go in at the top with some washi. And I'm thinking, like I like these critters, so I'm gonna put that at the top with some of this Simply Gilded, or I might just keep it to the Simply Gilded. We will see. And where's my ruler? It's like I start planning and then I realize, wait, there's stuff I actually need in order to plan. And I just had my ruler. Oh my god. Anyone else like this when they plan? They have all of their stuff and then suddenly it's missing. Oh, I can't find it. So I'm gonna have to just do a not a very fancy rip. Oh, I did not like that at all. I'm gonna have to cut. And... All right. Those are my scissors that have lots of stickers still on them. Oh, I like this color already. Really like this color already. Now I just want to make sure that I do put it down straight. There we go. There we go. I like that. I think that's really, really pretty so far. Now. Oh gosh, you know what I didn't even do? I didn't even go check to see what mild liners would work in this spread. I love saying that. I may not need it as of yet because they have the, she has a uh, habit tracker here on the side. Oh, already I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, let's figure this out. So I'm going to, let's see, I'm gonna place place this here because it's actually really really cute and then I have one habit tracker and that'll be for my sleep and it is actually a little tiny so it's fine I'm all over the place here guys and just write the word sleep And then I'm going to find my sleep emoji from my big batch of stickers here. Look how cute is that? And then I number this um, with four, five, six, seven, eight. Normally I number it to nine, but and then Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Okay, and then I need another one underneath it for my workouts. So okay. one for workouts. Oh, this is interesting. I've never actually used these before, so I'm actually going to just put this ooh, with washi. I think I'm gonna put that with washi. Because why not? Add washing wherever I can at this stage. And then I'm gonna add more. No, uh, we'll leave that. I'm gonna add this. Kind of these like emoji headers. Which are really cute. And then do my workout.
So now that I've gone ahead and done the sidebar, I think that's really cute. I feel like I'm going to keep the spread relatively simple. I feel like Helen's stickers just lend itself well to being very simple. I am going to put the weekend banner down. I don't normal. I say I don't normally, but that's a lie. Weekend. I love all the little emojis on there. They're just adorable. I'm going to go in and then start doing each day for my work schedule. But before I do that, I'm going to draw the line across. I'm going to make sure this time that it is exactly where I want it because I made the mistake last week of it not being exactly where I wanted it to be. It's still, I mean, the, the spread still is the spread still turned out really well, but the spacing bothered me. There we go. All right. Okay. Perfect. Now I really, I, the reason that I chose a Hobonichi kit instead of just a regular vertical kit was because of all that came with it. And it's, it's just so cute. So I'm going to go in and start filling out each day and then I'll talk through what I've done. So starting on Monday, I I'm trying to figure out what the best way is to label my works, but instead of just drawing an arrow, I actually highlight it with my Tombow and then add in my work script sticker. And then I add in this laptop from the Coffee Monsters Co. And then I take this to-do header and write down my list of to-dos for the day. And then I do the same thing with my mild liner and the work sticker for Tuesday with this cute Coffee and Monster Coffee Monsters Co. Modi. And then I decide to take the this week and put it on top of the sidebar. And then on Tuesday night, we do have to take out the garbage. And I love these cute emojis for taking out the garbage. On Wednesday, I use one of the full boxes because it is the kids' first day of school on Wednesday, both starting at the same day at the same time, first year that this is happening. So this is huge. And then I decide to add another full box down on Tuesday just to take up room, I guess. Um, and then I have to remind myself that I do have to pick up the kids because this is the first year that I'm dropping them off and picking them up as part of my routine. Thankfully, work is a lot more flexible that I can do that. So Thursday, I remind myself that I have to pick up the groceries after I drop off the kids at school, and then we have a puppy training at six o'clock that evening. Friday, label work the same way again and take this to-do sticker and actually put it on Thursday to label a couple of things like mop the floors. And then I put down these two full boxes, which are so cute. I love Helen's full boxes. And I love that they don't take up a ton of room. They maybe only take like a couple of hours. And then I do, I, I put a to-do sticker down on Friday for the videos I have to film. And then I know I have some work to do for the shop this week because I have releases coming out on September 4th. So I do have to print and cut for Saturday. And then I do have to make sure that the releases are all ready to go for Saturday morning at 9. And then Robin's horseback riding at 11. And then we're going to go into, I think part of it is missed here. Oh, yes, folding laundry on Saturday night because, you know, I'm so hip like that. And then there's part of the spread that is off the uh, camera here. But then I fill in my cleaning list for Sunday. I feel like you guys missed that part. So I'm just putting down these emoji heads to kind of separate certain areas to add something in the space. Oh, I don't like that being right next to that other one though. Yeah, more. Actually down here so that I have space to put something there. I actually really like this. This is super cute. So, so cute. And I mean, I still have a lot of stuff left over. Um, so I don't know. I don't know. It, I mean, this doesn't look anything like what I feel like Helen would make her kids look like. Like her, the way she makes her kids look is just amazing. So I'm going to hang on to whatever is left here. And then I'm going to go ahead and just write in breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And then go from there. I have decided though that because there's that new release there, I'm going to add add this and I'm gonna add it with hmm. 
feel like I'm gonna just, oh, this one's cute. I'm gonna add this here for the shop owner. But then I have like, I have the computer right next to the computer and that's not necessarily what I want. So I'm gonna take another, well, just this happy one. And then I'm gonna make sure. And I think just because this is my second release of things, it'll make it a lot, I say a lot easier. But I'm gonna add some more over here. Then I'm gonna add this arrow to kind of say that it's something that I should be kind of doing. Oh, <laughs> weak. All right, I'm gonna add that last thing at the bottom here and then I should be all done. <laughs> that's it okay but that is it for me it is such a cute spread and I need to get into the habit of using kits like these and I think the Hobonichi cousin kit from Coffee Monsters Co works so well in here I have another kit for I, I think it's no it's not for the cousin kit but I think cousin kits work well in this that it fits well in those spaces so it doesn't actually cover the hours uh, on the day there but yeah i really like it i think it's it's really cute and i mean it's definitely a lighter type of pastel color than i'm used to but i do really like it all right but that is it for me thank you guys so much for watching if you have any questions please leave them in the comments below if you like this video please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching and have a great day